Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Arcanum. Alright, well, uh, it's time to go uh, meet with Pollock. Who we did, uh, you know, murder a while ago. Whose house is this? This is Pollock's house, and he don't like strangers hanging around here. I'm no stranger. Miranda Tears told me to go and speak with him. Oh, it's you. Yeah, he, he's expecting you. He knocks on the door. Hey, boss, it's a new girl. She's here to talk to you. Go on in. If we hear any trouble, you're dead. I'll remember that. There's a couple uh, treasure chests back there, which are also probably empty. Oh, the girl that'd be making so much noise here in the boil. The half-ogre before you is huge. His face heavily scarred. Pollock, I assume? Yeah, I be Pollock. Well, that's a name you gotta be remembering, girl. Yeah, I'm sure of that. He eyes Virgil suspiciously. Hey, don't I know you over there? Pollock never forgetting a face. I know I've seen yours. Maybe you've been to the boil before? Virgil? I, I, I... Uh don't know what you're talking about, Pollock. I, I'm sure we've never seen each other before today. Be careful with him. I've heard uh, rumors about him. Virgil, are you sure you've never been here before? This is not the time or the place to talk about such things. Just watch yourself and be smart about what you say. All right, Virgil. I'm sorry, Pollock, you were saying? Yes, I be Pollock, and I be the leader of this gang. He looks you over, his fists clenching and unclenching. You like making noise? Pollock don't like people making too much noise. I'll be the leader of this gang. You savvy? Um, I'll decide where and when I make noise. You savvy? He stands over you menacing with raised fists. You're not strong enough to be speaking to Pollock like that girl. We're gonna get this straight right now. This be my gang. And I not be taking words from girls like you, savvy? Enough of your posturing, Ogre. Shut up. Shut your mouth and sit down. Well, alright. I had a feeling that was gonna come. It's fine. Let's drink some of that. And he's dead. Oh no, they've broken in. I'll just pass for now. Go dog meat! Yeah, rip their faces off. <laughs> Can't see him. There we go. What do we have on you? Some armor? Uh... You okay there, Magnus? Just gonna... just gonna hold the door? I might have missed some... stuff. Oh, whoops. Forgot I was so low on, uh... Alright. No, you're not gonna... not gonna come help. Alright. Well, let's see. Do guys. All right. Can I come out? Whoops. They seem to be a little bit bugged out. 
Whoops. Arf. <laughs> that was a critical miss. Alright. There we go. He's, uh... He doesn't know what to do now, apparently. There we go. There we go. Alright. Chuka. Take some of that. Take that? Yes, you can. Very good. All right, you're basically full. Although I could give you some of these. There we go. And the mushrooms. There we go. Now you're full. Fill, a, fill him up on uh, stuff. Uh, you can take a couple things. Not that. You can't take that. You can't take that. I gotta sell some stuff. that I can t pick up. And what about this body here? Okay. Uh, let's see if I can give any of this to anyone. Take that. You can take that. Take both of those. And there we go. Total of four spots left. All right, now these two are both locked. Did not get a key on him. And my unlocking camper did not work. I don't know how to... I don't know how to actually force attack. I can't harm it. All right, let me uh, let me pull out the uh, quick reference thing. Uh, let's see. Guys, move away from there. You having fun there, Virgil? There we go. Um. Oh. All right. 
Now, guys, move out of the way. Let's go see what we picked up. 10,000 gold and a junk pile. I get that. I cannot get this quality axe. <laughs> Alright, anything else? Anyone else with uh, spare space? You do have some spare space. I'll give you all these rings. You can take the mushrooms. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. There's a nice pile of corpses right there at the door now. <laughs> oh, it's fun times. They will probably be hostile to me, so I need to go sell some stuff first. Then we can go uh, say hi to Miranda and her friends. I mean, they did attack me earlier last time, you know, when I was in here. So I, I feel justified in, in doing all of that. All right, Mr. Junk Dealer. Um, let's see... I would like to sell you all of these. Thank you. Thank you very much. What are you selling today? What's the news? You're not going to announce the news? No, not going to announce the news. Stupid paper boy. Go back to riding your bicycle and throwing newspapers in people's windows. I wonder if Disintegrate does destroy items that they're carrying. glares at you. Haven't you heard? The boss is dead. Pollock's gang is through, and so am I. She turns away from you, shaking your, shaking her, her head. Get out of my sight. Uh, do do do. Is Pollock? Uh, nope. All right. She's actually fifty-one towards me. Neutral. Um. Oh, well, I got a job that needs doing. Might be easy, or it might be, might get messy. You never know here in the boil. Um, I'd be interested in hearing more about it. Well, I get a pretty regular shipment of whiskey every week. Except lately, one of the gang's been stealing it. Normally, I don't get any trouble from them, but neither one is owning up up to it because they know somebody's getting their skull smashed when I find out who it is. Uh, I see. What is it you need me for? Well, I need somebody to go and pick up the whiskey for me. I'm running real low. You pick it up, and I'll give you 500 gold pieces when you get back here. What do you think? Sure, sounds good. What do I have to do? Man's name is Biggs. He'll be waiting for you in the middle of the Garillon Bridge at the towers. I'll send a boy over there. Tell him you'll be waiting for to be waiting for you. Watch yourself, lass. The boy ain't a place to be getting careless. You hear me? I'm going now. Alrighty. That sounds like something I can do. It's getting dark now, though. Well... That was silly of you. 
I'll take that stuff. Hello! Hey there, you're Caleb's girl, right? Hey, you told me to be expecting you. I'm Biggs. Yes, I'm here for the whiskey. Yeah, yeah, I got it right here. My delivery boys keep getting mugged on the way to, to Malloy's. Hopefully you'll have better luck. Thank you, Biggs. Mugged, you say, huh? There we go. I'm not doing anything to you, jeez. All right, where's the other one? There we go. I'll take that. All right. I had a feeling there'd be some uh, hostiles on the way. But we have taken care of them. <laughs> Do not expect any help. I think we're good. We're good. Alright, uh, I picked up the whis whiskey. Here it is. Thank you, that's grand lass. Thank you so much for the help. Here's your money. He hands you a handful of gold. Uh, 500 gold coins is a handful. You're welcome in Malloy's anytime. Alright, must be off. I was kind of expecting them to uh, fight me, but... Oh well. I'm good. That was fun. Just slaughter my way through everyone in the boil. There's no gangs there anymore. Taking care of the problem. Uh, clean up on uh, aisle four, please. Petty thefts continue. Read all about it. Now, I think I have some quests that I can do here. Alright, those are taken care of. Accepted Eric Obsidian wants you to find the lost burial ground of the Iron Clan, retrieve the Durin Stone. Accepted Thrain Ironheart wants you to find his brother Erland at the Stonecutter Clan, tell him to return home. Accepted find out what happened to the Black Mountain Clan. Accepted find the Elven Village of Kintara. Accepted kill the three wild pigs, keep eating the Theo Bright Starts corn crop. That's right. Uh, mentioned Ogden wishes you to bring the book The Hand to him. Although I don't know that I can get back there now. Accepted. Find Warren Liana Peldar of Cumbria and tell her about Maximilian. Yep, alright. That's that we could do. Botched that. Accepted. Ms. Cameron would like you to find her son Liam. Accepted. Sarah Toon wants you to help her regain... Ownership of the Bessie Tune Mine, and we do that. Botched that one. Mentioned Benjamin Benjamin Gershwin, the phrenologist, wants you to bring the skulls of Renar, the Renar Siamese twins. Accepted Percival Tune wants you to find a way to free the ghost of his mother. Mentioned if in my travels I happen across the ancient elven amulet of Natala, Galen has offered me to pay a handsome reward for it. It should say what city these things are in and stuff. Uh, okay, I can't actually do anything with that. Is that really all my quests? It feels like there should be more. Alright, well, um... I actually need to, uh figure out who I need to talk to about the uh, the Bessie Tune mine. Uh, I'll do that eventually, though. Uh, let's see. Let us trade, sir. I'll sell you all that stuff. Have some more axes. Need to keep an eye on how much money he has. Because eventually he's going to stop paying me anything. Uh, 
I would rather not sell things in that state. I don't know what I'm going to do with all that stuff. All right, I got more axes for you. He's got a lot of money right now. Pretty sure I ran him out a while ago. But then again, I was selling uh, magic items, which go for considerably more. I don't think I need that. I don't know if he will buy some of these other things from me. I don't think he'll buy those. Two coins for that, that works for me. 23. 22. You will not give me any of the give me anything for any of those. All right. Sounds good. All right, let's go get the uh, that robe identified. We'll see if uh, the wise woman has any other items for sale as well. Might just buy any rings that she has. I got tons of money. Rings and amulets. I mean, we can always get better stuff later if we find, you know, buy or find them. Alright, Chuka. Let's go ahead and take that. Right, could you identify something for me? Okay, shadowed robes, that's all I had. Uh, let's barter, what do you have? You have arcane chain mail. Uh, that might be good for Virgil. Shadowing robes, enchanted war boots, speed plus five, light fingered gauntlets, another sort of sickness. Buy all of those. Alright, what do you got? You've got magic chain mail. Uh, all resistance is plus 10. All resistance is plus 20. Yeah, that looks better. And... Let me take those. Someone might be uh, good with those. That's better. So it's 66 versus 56. Yep. That's just better. Um, and this actually weighs a little tiny bit more. Okay, Elven Boots, DR plus 5, also increases armor class. It's going to be a little bit better. Speed plus five is good. All right, elven boots. Anyone want elven boots? We've got metal boots. You 
we've got fine stout boots. You've got fine stout boots. And what do I have? I have enchanted war boots, which I do like. All right. She did not have any rings, unfortunately. I think I'll keep the uh, the elven boots for now. I might uh, find a, another companion. I can have another companion at the moment, so. And I do know of another companion that I would like to get. I'll take that. I'll sell it. I think I'll... I may check the, uh... Magic shop off-screen. See if there's anything good in there. Someone has thrown out a metal can. That should be recycled. It's terrible people. Alright. Uh, I'll keep that. Three. That sounds good. Okay, worth 724, but you only have 239. Alright, I've used up all... I've, I've drained him of cash. Alright, it's a little bit early, but uh, I'm going to need to figure out where I need to go for the Bessie Toon thing, because uh, it's about that time anyway, uh, to take care of that quest. Um, may look around to see if there's any other good quests that I can do in this town as well. And when we come back next time, uh, we will get back on to uh, finding what has happened to the Black Mountain Clan. See you next time, everyone.